Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. And in today's tutorial, guys, I'll be showing you for both Android as well as iOS or Apple devices how to use the very cool WhatsApp web or WhatsApp desktop. Now, of course, this is a cool feature that allows you to use um, WhatsApp on your computer. As you can see, I have my computer. I have two monitors connected. I have the regular laptop over here. And have my secondary monitor now the first thing you want to do guys is just launch on your computer the web browser you're going to go to this website here and the address is www.web.whatsapp.com you can see the address right up here and that's this address that's webwhatsapp.com now as you can see here guys the code will be shown on screen as seen here to be a unique code that's generated Notice every now and again it changes, meaning even if you were to copy the one shown here, it should change after a while. So it will keep generating like that. And of course, what you want to do next is go ahead on your um, device. As in my case here, I have um, the iPhone 11. doesn't really matter which iPhone or iOS device, including iPods and so on. Go ahead and make sure you have WhatsApp installed. You're going to launch um, WhatsApp. And as you can see here, um, you might be on the chats menu down here. So you might be in your chats. Simply tap on the gear icon, lower right. Then of course, as you see here, you'll have a bunch of features. Look out for the one that shows the laptop, which is the second option here. Go ahead and um, tap. And of course, you'll be generating a code. It's basically, well, not generating a code, but it'll show you what to do. Notice it shows you that you'll need to scan using their built-in scanner in WhatsApp. Well, all right, guys, so in case you're on um, WhatsApp on your Android device, it's slightly different. But however, the works, it works the same. You're going to scan using the built-in um, app as seen here. So just go ahead and go ahead and um, hit WhatsApp. And if you're here on the main menu, which is where your chats is at, hit the three dots. Once you hit the three dots, guys, you should see up here where it says WhatsApp web, which is the third one from the top go ahead and tap and there you go all you gotta do now is for um an android is just go ahead and hit ok and of course once you do that the scanner is going to be up you're going to point it at your um, laptop screen now of course again if you have waited too long on the desktop it'll ask you to click to regenerate so i'm going to click to regenerate as shown here and of course it's regenerating and then i'm going to hit ok down here or I'm just going to hit that and of course I'm going to scan notice this right now notice it beeps and of course once it beeps notice I have been um, logged in now of course I'm now on my desktop or of course in my web browser notice I have a bunch of um, cool features among them you'll see that you can get notifications um, you can keep your phone connected as well in case you want to work like this, this is great for sending over files and also communicating with people more efficiently when you're away from your phone or if you need to send files via this um, medium. All right, so the first thing I want to see here, guys, you can turn on notification. And this is a cool feature that's called um, desktop notifications. And as you can see here, let me just show you what's going to happen. Simply tap and it will ask you to allow. I'm going to say allow notifications. And there you go it's allowing notifications meaning as soon as a message comes in it should pop up down here and of course um, that's one of the cool features of this um, feature that's built into whatsapp that you might not have noticed please go ahead and make sure that you give it a try it will also work on your um, android device as i showed in both cases where to find the settings all right guys those are another few tips you can also get um, whatsapp it's available for Windows, meaning you can get WhatsApp on Windows. That's an alternative. You don't have to use this method as um, it's already cool to use it in the web browser. Um, over here, you can find um, messages if you need to create a new chat. You can go into settings just as on your um, device. So you see here, you can go into settings. You do have option for notifications and so on. Notice the notifications from before. You can change wallpaper, block, and help. And of course, I can go um, back. You can also see right over here, you can mess with your status from here. So you can basically do anything that you would on the phone from your desktop 
and this is all in browser and it's very cool also guys um, just in case when you're finished and you want to disconnect and you don't want to use it anymore on your um, desktop go ahead and hit um, this icon here and you can go ahead and log out which will log you out from the browser here you can simply leave it as is the choice is yours also in case you're curious you still have um, access from your um, device and guys so as usual guys regarding the gardener from block tech tips when i said a cool tips showing you how to use the um whatsapp on your desktop all right so record a garden saying bye until next time bye guys mm -hmm.